The soul of mankind is sick. Yeah, yeah. And that doesn't mean that people have to remain sick. Right. It just means that if we don't treat the soul sickness, we're going to have whole sickness. Mm -hmm. We're going to have sickness in our families. We're going to have sickness in our society as we do, because it all starts with the inner life, yeah. the soul life. And I just want I want people to hear me when I say this. We've 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 bandaged, we've poorly bandaged up our souls for years and we've poorly bandaged up the collective soul of our world for years. And we got to really rip the bandage off and heal the wounds. We want to heal the wounds of abuse that you've had as if you had that as a child, we want to heal the wounds of rejection. If you've suffered that, we want to heal the wounds of fear. We want to heal, heal the wounds of anxiety. We want to heal the wounds of being unloved when you were a kid. Uh, we want to heal the wounds of the mistreatment, the injustice that's been done to your soul. Like God wants to heal all that stuff. Yeah. And if I can say it like this, if you could, if you look at your life like this, you look at, look at your soul, like it's the kitchen, your body is the dining room of a restaurant. Mm. That's what people look at. That's what people eat from. That's, that's what good. people, um, that's what show, that's what you showcase, right? Right. That's what's in the spotlight. Your body is in the spotlight, but your body is just the, 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 the body is just the presentation mm -hmm. yeah. of what happens in the kitchen, right? What happens in the kitchen? See the, the dining room might look really clean, but if there's germs in the kitchen, somebody's getting food poisoning. Yeah. No matter how, you know, much you right. No matter yeah. how much you spray your hands, yeah. no matter how much you wash your hands, no matter how no matter how clean you, no matter how masked up you are, we got to get healthy in our soul and we can resist anything. We can fight anything. We can overcome anything. We can endure anything when we get healthy in our soul. So what's happening in the kitchen is so mm -hmm. important because yep. It doesn't matter. Like, it, yep. You can look really good on the outside, but if if the right ingredients aren't put, mm -hmm. if there's not care, you think about what makes Thanksgiving dinner for most people such a fun time mm -hmm. for people that do have a fun time with it. And, and of course, a lot of people don't have fun with it. A lot of people are suffering still sure. on holidays. Sure. But if you think about what makes a, a good Thanksgiving dinner is what what's gone on in the kitchen, the care that went into yeah. the the care, the time, the energy, the effort, the, the love that went into that yeah, meal really good. is what makes a happy table mm -hmm. when you sit down with the people that you care about and the people that you're connected to. It's, yeah. it's what happened in the kitchen that sets the tone. Like mm -hmm. if, if there's strife in the kitchen, it's going to show up at the table. If there's strife in the kitchen, it's going to show up in the bedroom. If the strife in the kitchen is going to show up in the school, if there's strife in the kitchen, yeah. it's going to, yeah. it's going to show up in your, in every area of your life, in your business, in your financial decisions. G John said it this way in third John verse two, beloved, I wish above all things that you would prosper and be in good health just as your soul prospers. So I want you to see like, that you may prosper. That's what you do, mm -hmm. but that your soul prospers. That's who you are. Yeah. yeah. That your soul prospers is who you are, that you prosper in all respects of your life. That's what you do. Right. I prosper in these areas of my life yeah. because my soul that's is good. prospering. Yeah. And if my soul is sick or poor or broken or in afflicted, then that's going to start showing up in every area of my life. And I want people yeah. to get healthy. I want you to get healthy in your soul.